want you to any. I fucked up. I fucked up really fast, like five seconds in. Welcome to adding to the Super NES. Been a long time. First game, Pac-Man 2. Came with the little, the little coaster for it. It's right in there, keeps it clean. It actually started right up on the first try. I like what they did. They put a O there. It's 99 cents, but they wanted to make sure that wasn't, you know, thought of as $99. So they put that big fat zero, and they got it for a dollar. And it's actually worth around that. It's like 2 or $3, something like that. And I keep on buying this game and mistaking it. It's a point and click game, actually, and I hate it. And I played it. You ever wonder what Gunstar Heroes would be? If it was boring and slow? It'd be Pac-Man 2 to New Adventures. This game's killing me. It fucking sucks. I am the slingshot. Fuck you, Pac-Man. Fuck you. You suck in the 90s, you fucktard. Go back to Namco and suck someone's dick to give you a better game, you piece of shit. Right in the face. Ooh, is that East Indian? Fuck you. Oh, ring your bell, bitch. Let me kill that fucking cat. Play one hand. <laughs> Come on! <laughs> uh, and shoot him in the balls. And those teeth, people. Alright, so this one's kind of a funny tale. We're not really funny, but this is Ramna, Ranma, and a half. Uh, that anime that used to go come out of Toonami after DBZ for a while, and I never watched it because it sucked. It was about a hermaphrodite who would change at weird times, and you know, different characters would try to have sex with him, her. I think I think that's what it's about, right? I don't know. I never watched it, but I saw previews and I thought that sucks. There are a lot of these weird lovey dubby uh, animes that uh, I had no interest in, and uh, even. Tenchi in Japan and Tokyo that that seemed crazy so anyway the story behind this is like I thought it was super rare when I was thinking about driving after I saw it at the Goodwill so I went back to Goodwill and bought it and I found out it's not rare at all it's actually going up in price so when I first bought this it was like at two dollars and now it's at seven so yippee and uh, here's some gameplay here's some Rama <laughs> I don't know how you pronounce it. Rama one and a half. Or a half. Rama half. Oh, there we go. Start. Press, press and start. That's racist. I'm sorry, but that, that's clearly a Negro man. woman. Where's the hermaphrodite? I want to play as the hermaphrodite. I think that's the hermaphrodite. Let's, you know, let's lure him in with my pussy and then strike him with my dick. She's got a fucking snow shovel. I don't know what jump is. Jump is X. And I'm dead. See, all my moves involve jumping. That's how I'm good at these smash em ups. Like the tides turn, you bitch. You're gonna snow off. Gonna snow pal out my driveway. Wow. This is awful. She finished. Die! Plow my driveway! Come on. Oh, that's so useless. Yes! Victory is mine for now and forever. This game sucks. Rama, darling, I yield to you. Damn straight. My apologies, dear. Yo, yo, you go. Rama receives credit for art class. What? That seems kind of, uh, underwhelming.
Ooh, well, we'll save it for the panda fight. It actually looks pretty cool. He's strong. Fuck. Oh, you fat bastard. I don't care if you're instinct. I don't give a shit if you don't. Fuck, you piece of shit panda. Oh my god, his bear hugs are appropriately titled and also drain me of a lot of health. Oh god! I don't care if I'm a woman half man, I was all woman just then. Oh, you piece of shit. No! No, not like this. My god, that's an instant kill. Fuck this game, it's off. It's a basic fighter, it's nothing special. It's really Street Fighter, you know, it set that high standard. And uh, everything that's lesser than Street Fighter kind of really fails in comparison, sadly. And, but on the other side, you know, it's not as bad as Shaq Fu. There's just a wide margin for fighting games, and it's better than Shaq Fu. I mean, it was a little faster, and the characters were so much bigger. So there you go. Um, all right, this is our real deal here. This is our real deal right here. I don't know if you, you may have saw the packaging while I was talking about those shitty games. All right, so there's this like uh, there's this big flea market called Smiley's, and I went there, and there was this old man who had like a cool neon uh, Nintendo sign, a big one about the size of a 32, about 32 inch TV size. So he had a nice one of those going, and he had a bunch of video games. He was an older man, and he seems to, to not know a bunch about them, but he sells like he sold like a NES, Super NES. Uh, uh, console that played both a reproduction uh, gaming system and he tried to that was what he was really pushing it was something like 40 bucks or something and he was pushing that heavily he had a lot of boxes so it, it seems like he kind of maybe he took over someone else's business or maybe just a lot of people don't know what they're doing out there that could be the case who knows but at Smiley's this guy was cool he seemed nice and I, I was thumbing through his games and a lot of them were in these uh, boxes like this um and I got Pocky and Rocky uh, for the Super NES with the booklet. I will show some mess up, which kind of sucks, is the back label. It was torn to smithereens. But it's weird because the rest of the game is pretty mint. It's, I guess that's what you get. Uh, it was at a movie stop. Yeah. So, or, yeah, Pocky and Rocky for Super NES. I think the sequel's worth more. But I looked this up currently, and it was worth around fifty-seven dollars, and I paid, I paid five dollars. It's real nice old guy too. It's real nice. Uh, I bought some NES games too. I got a box game up there. I forget which. It's been so long. Okay, it was The Legend of Cage and Demon Sword, and one was five, and like one was seven. So yeah, and Pocky and Rocky. Which is awesome. I mean, see for yourself. It's really addictive. Fuck you. How did I do it? I'm on some kind of weird rabbit toad gremlin thing. And I am kicking ass. That was fun. These graphics are so crisp. Oh, this is a great multiplayer game, but I only have one person here. My brother's selling his soul on Craigslist. So, just, you know, see how good it is and how crisp it is like this. And just think about it with another person playing. Oh, man. I took a three bald man butt stomp. And it killed me. Oh, man. It double leaves, bitch. You gotta get fucked up in this Ms. House. Uh, it, it holds up totally. This is just well made. I mean, this is—I guess that's a part of why it's so expensive. I think also because it's a foreign title. Oh, it's touch me and it doesn't hurt. Whoa! Slow down. We got some slow down there. I'm just pressing on. Oh my god. Whoa. 
So the character is black and he's spitting what appears to be watermelon seeds at me. I, I don't know. Look at this for yourselves. I'm not lying, people. Japan's racist. We all knew it. But they actually got away with it in America. You just can't do this kind of things. Because black people are the only race that ever go through slavery. And thus they're untouchable. Leave them alone. God. Damn Japs. Sideways vagina losers. We're just gonna get to the end again. Oh man, I'm about to die. Slow down. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh! I was jumping and jiving, folks. We had some fun, right? Oh, I'm still alive. I gotta fight this bush baby. See him? I'm running his pattern. Ooh, that was a close one. Oh man, he should move back the seeds. He is a genius. And I don't think anyone's beaten him in the history of video games, so. Yeah, so I mean, these are some pretty good deals. They're pretty good. Uh, you know, the first two. Uh, yeah, actually, uh, I may try the Rama battle, hard battle thing. Whatever that is. And I don't like saying half. Usually there's a number that comes before half. So when I just say half, it feels wrong. I hate it. Rama half. Half a Rama. Rama. And the, but the Pac-Man game is totally sucky. It just, it takes so long to, anything to set up. It just, oh, I feel like throwing up when I'm playing it. It just, it just takes too long. It's, it's really kiddy, I guess. I don't know if kids have that much patience either, though. It, there's a lot of tutorials that jump up on the screen when you do something wrong or you, 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 they think you're stuck. They're trying to help you out. And uh, no one needs that. But in the real deal here, the rock, Pocky and Rocky. I want to say Rocky and Pocky. I've already discussed this. It's my American influence. Damn. These broad shoulders, apple-eating pie lips. Because I can't stop myself from being on the straight and narrow of the USA. This is up there. That my Super NES collection is probably better now than my NES just for this one purchase. Because a lot of those NES games cost two, three dollars. That thing is worth money. And they came with a booklet. It's a little crumpled. Let's see. We'll end it. See if they. Yeah. This is the sad part about games versus Nintendo. Nintendo would make their own like character sprites and put them in the instruction booklets. And sadly, uh, Pocky and Rocky use well, they use clips. You know, squared out clips from the TV. Yeah, I mean, even closed up clips for the baddies. Uh, uh. Ooh, there's a Game Master challenge. Defeat this game and take a picture of the ending screen with your face in it for SNES and NES games. Send the picture to Natsumi. And you'll be de designated a Natsumi Game Master. And you'll be awarded the following prizes. Game Master sweatshirt. Not available in stores. Please specify size. XXXL, bitches. Two is a Game Master certificate. Suitable for framing. Hell yeah, I'm going to frame that bitch after I shellac it. And three, Game Master's names will appear in Natsumi newsletter. The following are games which qualify for the Game Master Challenge. Spanky's Quest. Tailgater? Yeah, Tailgater. Scat. God, these all sound like pornos. Pocky and Rocky. And there's some penguin game. Like Amazing Penguin. So, yeah. What a prize. Natsumi. You spoil me. You spoil me, Natsumi. So, yeah. Rocky and Pocky and Rocky! Stay here for now. Mm, good game. I actually got to get Demo to play it with me. So, yeah. 
Thanks for watching. Tune in next week to watch me play some more games and show more additions to my collection. Until then, spread this video around like wildfire, bitches. Put this on your Facebook page. Put this on your Twitters. Help me out, damn it. Help Noiji Tut. Can't believe I have to tell you to do that. You should be doing it on your own. You should be saying, I want to promote Noiji Tut. Because who knows how much longer he's going to do this with what little praise he gets. Damn it.